You have known each other from the first glance of acquaintance to this point of commitment. At some time, you decided to marry. From that moment of yes to this moment of yes, indeed, you have been making commitments in an informal way. All of those conversations that were held in a car or over a meal or during long walks, all those conversations began with when we're married and continued with I will and you will and we will. All those late night talks that included someday and somehow and maybe, and all those promises that are unspoken matters of the heart. All these common things and more are the real process of a wedding. The symbolic vows that you are about to make are a way of saying to one another, you know all of those things that we've promised and hoped and dreamed. Well, I meant it all, every word. Look at one another and remember this moment in time. Before this moment, you have been many things to one another. Acquaintance, friend, companion, lover, dancing, partner, even teacher. For you have learned how much from one another these past years. Shortly, you shall say a few words that will take you across the threshold of life and things between you will never quite be the same. For after today, you shall say to the world, this is my husband, this is my wife. Frederick, you came into my life at exactly the right time. I might not have known it then, but it was when I needed your love the most. And it may have taken a few times for me to say yes to being your girlfriend, but when you asked me to be your wife, it was the easiest decision I have ever made. It has been my greatest pleasure getting to grow into a adulthood beside you. Sorry. <laughs> hardest working, most caring, incredibly patient, and level-headed partner and best friend I could ask for. You constantly make me feel safe, loved, and supported. There are so many things I love about you, but here are a few of my favorites. I love that your mouth twitches when you're trying not to laugh. I love that when you do laugh too much, you get the hiccups. I love that we have a daily big hug and you never forget. I love that you say you don't like to sing in front of people, yet one of my favorite memories is you belting out Florida Georgia Line in your truck on the way to a lot at UNH. Similarly, I love that you say you don't like to dance. Slow dance with me in the morning, even when my roommates catch us. I love that you're selfless and stubborn and grew up with the same love for Winnie the Pooh as I did. And I love that I get to spend the rest of my life with you. As your wife, there are a few things that I promise to do. I promise to start doing at least one household chore. Should we have children, I promise to be as good as a mom as you are a plant and a fish dad. I promise to support your dreams and business adventures. I promise to be your shoulder to lean on during tough times. I promise to stand by your side no matter what. I can't wait to spend my forever with you. I love you. Ever since I met you all the years ago, I picture us in this very moment, sharing a future together and making lasting memories together. I love you for who you are, your caring, forgiving, loving, and never afraid to be your true self. I vow to love you no matter what, how messy you make the house, how many times you rearrange the furniture, or when you want to try something new. I always, I'll always be by your side, you support me no matter what, 
whether it be in your listen to or an early tea time to get to. And I look forward to us to be by side by side on this wild ride we have together forever. And as a wise bear once said, any day spent with you is my favorite day, so today is my new favorite day. Today you gain an equal partner that you will be your confidant, your defender, your motivator through all of your aspirations and goals. You will celebrate each other's accomplishments, provide peace through every setback, and most importantly, give love in life's both big and little moments. You are creating a new home where love, trust, and loyalty are the foundation. No matter what the future throws your way, rely on those foundations, and you shall only see your bond grow stronger and your souls grow wider. Do you, Freddie, keep Ashley as your favorite person? To laugh with her, go on adventures with her, support her through life's tough moments, be proud of her, grow old with her, and find new reasons to love her every day? I do. Do you, Ashley, keep Freddie as your favorite person? To laugh with him, go on adventures with him, support him through life's tough moments, be proud of him, grow old with him, find new reasons to love him every day? I do. Ashley and Freddie, you have come here today before us and before God and have expressed your desire to become husband and wife. You have shown your love and affection by joining hands and have made promises of faith and devotion each to the other and have sealed these promises by giving and receiving of the rings. Therefore, it is my privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I am honored to introduce for the first time ever, Mr. and Mrs. Frederick Nader. <laughs> <laughs>